Hi Wesley, hi Sam, it's your mom. I just wanted to say hi to you guys and see how you're doing and see if you're happy. Uh, actually I'd rather have you call me and tell me how you are. Uh, can you hear the baby crying? He's trying to take a nap and he's not happy. Uh, I really appreciated your help, Sam, when you were here and it made things so much easier for me to function and get the house a little bit cleaner, but it was nice having you there. Um, it was like old times. Um, and Wesley, you're only here for a few minutes, but it was like awesome. Um, and I'm sorry, Sam, I wasn't able to give you a really good birthday at all, so because for me. Uh, we're real broke right now and we didn't know you were coming so uh, but next time if you do want to come up I promise we'll try to make things a little better uh, be more prepared to have other kids over um, I'm just glad that I got to see you again and that you're grown up and hopefully uh, some of the advice I gave you, you you stick with it and don't do anything different um, because there's a lot of girls out there that uh, will regret, have regretted what they've done. But you're a smart girl, Sam, and a lot of a lot of the boys do like you. But you need to be a lot smarter than some people are when they deal with boys. Um, sorry, Sam, that if that embarrass you, but I just miss you guys already and it's only been a couple hours but <laughs> I miss you guys um, I'm just glad that they have this invention with the computer and webcams and stuff because it's a way for me to be able to get a hold of you guys in a different way besides the phone so um, Wesley if you need to drive I would suggest that you start saving up for a car I know this is like a duh moment where you say, duh, but I just want to say it because I have a 16 year old kid I can say it to. Um, it's just really cool. Um, and I remember being 16 and driving and it's just like awesome. Uh, and Sam, you too, just, you gotta start working for what you want because it's not gonna come easy. And uh, Rodney really misses you guys, and I hope in the future that you guys can start seeing each other and a lot more. And when you grow up, you guys will be best friends. And the baby too, Nicholas. All right, you guys, I really, really miss you, and I hope to have you uh, come to my house maybe for Thanksgiving or Christmas or Easter or something, even if it's just for a day and it's not overnight. Okay, I'm not asking for a lot. Just, just know that I love you guys and I miss you and and I just can't imagine you guys not being around. But I've gotten used to it. But it still is not something I like. Um, Nick did say hi to you guys, even though he's not here to say it. But he does. He does. He likes you guys. You're cool. Um. And I hope you guys, I hope I see you guys a lot more than I have uh, in the past. And that uh, you feel comfortable enough to tell me things about yourself without feeling like I'm going to judge you. Because I'm not. Uh, and I hope you're brushing your teeth every day and flossing and all this junk you're supposed to do. And that you're doing your homework. And that you're getting along with other kids at the school and they're getting along with you. Because if not, then you need to do what you need to do to survive. Alright, well, watch my video or the other ones and tell me what you think and, like, either throw up on them or love them. Okay, bye.